Today's encouraging word comes from the book of Exodus, chapter 33, and we'll read verse number 11, and it says, And the Lord spake unto Moses face to face, as a man speaketh unto his friend. Amen. You know, one of the marks of friendship is that we generally and genuinely like the other person. We like who they are. We like being with them. We like spending time with them and, and, and talking to them. Um, we know they're not perfect, but we like them. It's the mark of friendship. Uh, even just the thought of them sometimes will uh, bring a smile to our face or make us feel good on the inside. It's good to have a friend and it's good to be a friend to someone else. Uh, and yet, we live in a time, obviously, where we can't please everybody. I don't know if there ever was a time where you could please everybody. There's always going to be someone who does not like you, who dislikes you. A neighbor, a co-worker, a family member. Uh, there are going to be people who don't like you. But one thing that should make you uh, just feel so joyful on the inside is to know that as a child of God, not only does He love you, He likes you. Uh, you see, Jesus said to His disciples, and He says unto us today, He says, I no longer call you servants. I now call you friends. We are friends of God. Just as Moses had a relationship with God that was characterized, among other things, as one of friendship. God spoke to Moses face to face as a man speaks to his friend. Jesus says, today I call you friend. And so right now you can know, not only does God love you, and that's wonderful, but God likes you. God likes who you are. Doesn't mean he's not trying to bring you to a place where you can be better and be more like Jesus, but God likes you. He, he, he likes your laugh. He, he likes your smile. He likes the twinkle in your eye. He likes the way you walk. He likes the way you do certain things, even though they may be a little off the wall. God yet likes your idiosyncrasies. God likes you. He likes being around you. He likes talking with you. He likes to spend time with you. God likes you. And so today, even though you may come into contact with people who don't like you. Even though this world may treat you in a manner that's harsh and may, maybe even cruel. Uh, find comfort today in a truth that there may be other people around here who don't like me, but that's okay because the God of all creation, my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, likes me. Amen. He likes me. You know, a few years ago when Sally Field won an Oscar, maybe more than a few years ago, she uh, gave a speech, and as part of her speech she says, you know, you like me. <laughs> you know, right now, you like me. And I want you to know that right now, God likes you. You may not feel too good about yourself, and maybe there's some things that need to be changed, but please understand, God likes you. So tell yourself today, uh, if you need it, if you need a boost, just tell yourself and remind yourself, recall to your mind the love of God that He has for you, but also this, that He likes you, that He considers you a friend. Isn't that wonderful? God bless you. Until next time, be encouraged and know that Jesus loves you and He likes you too. And His love never fails.